factor v binomial. So to do this, we're going to write this in a way that allows us to use the formula for the difference of squares. So recall that if you have x squared minus y squared, that's equal to x minus y times x plus y. So our goal is to write it as x squared minus y squared. So the 81 can be written as 9 squared minus, and then 64 is 8 squared, and then we still have the b squared here. The trick is now we can write this as 9 squared minus, and then you can write this as 8b and then parentheses squared. If you think about it, if you go backwards, you end up squaring the 8 and the b, so you get the same thing. And so now we can apply the formula. Our x here is equal to 9, and our y here is equal to 8b. So this will be equal to, let's see, 9 minus 8b, parentheses, 9 plus 8b. And that would be the factored form. I hope this video has been helpful.